Hey there, I thought I'd do a quick video about um, how we bulk up our tomatoes because um, we're still trying to get through bags of tomatoes from last season and uh, these ones are on their way. As you can see here, we've got a flower on uh, golden green here. And that should do really well here because it's got a, um, a lovely concrete block wall behind it, um, holds a lot of heat in the greenhouse and keeps things warm overnight. Um, so like most of our tomato varieties, um, or the ones we're growing this year, we've uh, um, had this growing inside for quite some time and as you can see there are like four or five plants there. Um, I let them all grow together and, and sort of uh, thinned them out from, from maybe seven or eight just to get the biggest strongest plants because I wanted to harvest the uh, laterals off them. You can see laterals growing in the back there in the back corner. So um, I also have uh, Gardener's Delight and Gardener's Delight is one of my favourite Eating tomatoes, you um, warm off the off the bush is obviously why they're called garden gardener's delight because they're just a mouthful. They're just beautiful. So, so um, these are separate plants. They had fallen over here in the back here, and um, they had stems running along the surface. Now, knowing the way that garden uh, that tomatoes um, operate. Uh, I cut off all the side foliage, um, obviously thinned out another one there as well, cut off all the side foliage, um, cut off all the laterals at the bottom parts, and then I've covered them all, I've pinned them down using steel pins, I wonder if I can see one of them, yep, steel pin there, um, to make sure that they're in contact with the earth, and then I've covered them. Now, tomatoes um, will drop roots all the way down there, so this will become an enormous root system for these tomatoes. Um, so as you can see now I've tied them up, I've uh, put another steel pin down this end of the plant and tied them so that they come upright. So I'll have this great big wall of Gardener's Delight here um, which is going to be easy to pick. Now obviously you get a lot of uh, uh, rubbish come off chopping back that much of the tomatoes but these are all laterals. Now I've got another cup of these inside, I just brought them back out. So. Um, as you can see, that's a lateral that's been growing very, very strong. I cut it off with a knife, so a good clean cut for the plant. And I've cut off all of the side foliage up beside here. I pop that into water. Well, within seven days, these will all have laterals, on, um, I'm sorry, roots on them. Um, and within a, um, maybe 10 days, they'll be ready to plant out um, or out into new pots. So really, really amazing way to bulk up. So from those six plants one two three four yeah six plants i've got 24 new plants on their way um, for these ones i've taken off all the laterals you can see there i've pulled it off um, i've taken off all the laterals for the lower half because actually don't want this to bush out i want them to grow up and produce lots and obviously i get a ton of um, leftover plant material which obviously makes great mulch now i'm going to keep this really water well watered and um, I will do another video later in the season and show you how this is grown because I think this will be a really big tomato year. Pretty excited about it. Cheers.